Hello, hello, hello. Welcome, welcome, welcome. My name is Kevin Owasuitoy and welcome, welcome to my website, my YouTube channel around teach yourself test automation. Right here, we are upskilling ourselves, right? We're trying to um, get into um, automation testing, right? And um, hopefully you're coming along, along with, uh, in that journey and um, upskilling yourself as well, right? And um, here we, we learn, we, we, we understand, we try and uh, capture our learning in our own way and uh, we share that, right? Uh, so we, we are um, not a teacher, but a facilit facilitator of knowledge, if you want to say something like that, right? But we have started with, well, I've, I've started to learn um, Cypress, right? Cypress. So the last video was why Cypress and why I'm going to learn Cypress and um, hopefully Cypress is a tool that you want to pick up as well. But so we want to um, set up the environment, right? So we want to set up the environment where you can run a, a Cypress. A, and just like Java, um, for Java projects, you, you have to install Java on your system. For your JavaScript projects, you have to have Node.js, right? So forgive me, I've already, I've already clicked on, um, I went on to Google and I went onto the Node.js official website and I got to this screen and I have clicked this because I think, well, they say it's recommended for most users, right? So once we get using it, if it doesn't work out, then we come, we come back to this one, right? And this is the screen I have got so far, right? So we are going to install some Node.js, and I think when, or maybe let's click next, next and find out what happens, right? Right, we'll just get some uh, license issues here. So we just accept that. We have to agree the license and then click next. So it's going to down, it's going to be installed in the program files, right? So you're going to have it in the program files, Node.js and program files once it's finished, right? So let's click next and just click next there and click next here again and we say install right so hopefully this doesn't take too long sorry about the washing machine noise again right so hopefully that's going to go silent this is not going to be a quick a quick, uh, quick video it's just to show you how to install node.js which is going to be used for our javascript um, uh, project which is cypress is run on JavaScript, right? And um, yeah, so just install your Node.js and set up the system uh, variables, right? So when you install a node, node on your machine, right? Or on your system, yes, you have a node on your system, but your system doesn't know the location on which, uh, uh, where, where node is located on your machine, right? So you have to set up a system, a variable path to wherever node is stored on your machine so that uh, once you start running your your, your um, yeah so that when you start running your cypress um, which is <laughs> which requires node as a yeah then the system would find where you you know use node to actually run your cases but this is taking forever so we might come back when this is finished okay right we have some movement right we have some movement so I thought I'd bring you in <laughs> So we know where to go and find this, right? We know where to go and find this once it's uh, downloaded, right, in the program files. And then we're going to have to copy our program file path and then take that path to our system variables, right? I'll show you, show you what to do there. If this is going to take long again, we might just have to pause the video so we don't have to wait for too long. Yeah, we're going to be back, right? Sorry about this. Welcome back. I just wanted to show you the end, the end screen for the Node.js. Uh, Node.js um, wizard setup. Click the finish button to exit the wizard, uh, the setup wizard. Node.js has been successfully installed. So let's go to our, just click finished. And we we'll go to our program files, right? Click the program files and see if we've got Node.js no in there. 
so if we go to go to C drive program files we have to look for n m n node.js that's it down there right so if we double click inside node.js so this is our path where we have our node.js right so we're going to copy this and we go to i just go in here and i will type environmental edit edit the environment variables just click there go down to environmental variables here you see we've got java same kind of setup with java and uh, maven so i've done a few setups with that here as well so all you need to do is click new and just say node underscore home right and then we're just going to stick our path in here right stick our path in here so now we have installed node.js and the system knows where our node.js is located on our computer and it will execute any of the test cases that require node.js okay now i'll just click okay and okay again and okay and i go back to my yeah that's it that's us downloaded and set up our system variables for the node.js on our system right our laptop or whatever you're using desktop or whatever right thank you very much for watching and i am excited to start um, learning some um, cypress i hope hope you are too um, i think this next thing to do is to install um, studio uh, visual visual studio code something like that i'll look into it and uh, that, that's the next thing we'll have to install right and then the environment should be set up and uh, we have to start learning some cypress okay my name is kevin owasu if you found this video um, um, any value from the, you got any value from this video uh, consider subs i mean yeah subscribe to the channel follow follow our, our journey or you um tick the bell icon to be get notified when videos come along and also after subscribing and and also give a thumbs up okay my name is kevin over so you stay blessed always okay thank you bye <laughs> we are back again we are back again we have to stop it now <laughs>